A well-known police commander is on restricted duty as APD investigates claims he assaulted a woman he was dating. KXAN police reporter Jacqueline Powell is here to explain what we know about this accusation. Well, Robert, Sydney, we've learned a lot from this search warrant. It's for APD commander Jason Dusterhoff's phone after a woman gave detectives a detailed interview saying that she had dated him and he'd assaulted her. The name Jason Dusterhoff might sound familiar. He's been in the news before. Dusterhoff was an assistant police chief at APD until he was demoted back to commander last August. At the time, APD wouldn't give us a reason for that demotion. A year later, in this search warrant, a detective writes out the details of an interview with a woman who says Dusterhoff assaulted her on multiple occasions. The woman's name is protected. She's only listed as Jane Doe. She told detectives she started dating Dusterhoff in July. She said in late August, they got into an argument at a business on North Lamar. That's where she says he grabbed her face, then slapped her. Detectives say she also provided a picture of bruising under her chin that matches her description of the attack. This warrant says she handed over her phone, showing detectives text messages sent to and from Dusterhoff related to both that night and other times she says he assaulted her. She gave investigators permission to do a forensic evaluation on her phone as they searched through Dusterhoff's as well. Well, tonight I spoke with a friend of that woman's who said she was there on the night when the reported assault took place. She told me this woman had met Dusterhoff on a dating app and that she had come home bruised and beaten several times before. The friend told me this woman had told her she was in fear of her safety. And we're going to continue to dig into this story. And of course, we'll keep you updated as we learn more. But Sydney and Robert, I do want to reiterate that Dusterhoff has not been arrested or charged. Jackie, thank you. We did speak to Dusterhoff's attorney tonight. He told us that the young lady is not telling the truth. She is lying about Jason Dusterhoff doing anything physically violent to her and added that there's no evidence to prove that she's not telling the truth.